everybody, this is Julie with Ready, Set, Stamp .com. and this is actually a door hanger and you can also get these from uh, bags, tags, boxes and more from the Cricut cartridge if you wanted to cut one out. These actually came pre-cut like this and I can't remember, I think that I got them from Stampin' Up! years and years and years ago. So another thing you can do too is I will put a link, I found this site that has great templates so I know that there is a door hanger on here. So aside from the obvious, which you can make this into a door hanger, this makes a really, really cute treat holder. So let me show you how that works. This is a Happy Holiday stamp that I got from Hampton Arts Stamp set that I purchased. Actually, I didn't purchase. I got from eBay and Steve had sent. And this is called Candy Canes. I think it's absolutely darling. I think it's so cute. So one of two things. You can either stamp the image and stamp it onto here or and then color it in or you can color it in first and then stamp it. For me in this case I am going to go ahead and stamp it and I'm using some stays on ink here. I'm just going to go ahead and stamp this on so I'll show you just kind of randomly put the images on here like so and I'll do about four and the reason why I'm, why I'm only doing four is because you'll be ending up folding this. So once this, um, and it doesn't take long to dry, but once it dries, then go ahead and take your markers and color it in to the color that you would like to have for the candy canes or whatever stamp you have for your holiday stamp. And like I said, if you want this for a baby shower, then you'd stamp baby shower images. But anyway, so I'm going to move and set this aside so you guys can see what I've done here. So what I've done, this is a door hanger, and you can see that I've only stamped half of it. The reason being is that you fold it up like this, and isn't that so cute how this is decorated, and what a great, this is also really good at the bazaar, so if any of you are doing bazaars, really great idea. What I've done here is taken some just white chocolate candies, these are actually candy um, melts where you'll melt them and put them into candy molds, but this is all I had. You can do uh, some of those chocolate bells for Christmas, or if you'd like to use some mints, some of those butter mints if it was a baby shower, or some of those star mints I think are a great idea and they're very festive looking. So anyway, just an idea. This is just a regular bag that you would use uh, for a card, a cellophane bag, to put uh, a card in, but I didn't have any smaller bags. So anyway, I'm just using it for demonstration purposes so that you guys can see it. And what I have done here is put some double stick adhesive and I do recommend the stronger double stick adhesive onto this. It's just my preference to keep it really held together nicely. So what you do is you just put your little candies in here and you kind of press it into the back and then you take this portion, fold it upwards, press it onto the top here, keep it all locked in place like that. And that's super cute. And for one last thing, what I like to do is take the same design that you have here, stamp. Okay, so if you'd like to use, I'm using glossy cardstock, so I've stamped onto glossy cardstock here, extra paper that I had. And then I just colored in the image, and then I cut it out and stuck it onto some green paper. You could just use coordinating paper, so of course it could be red or whatever you'd prefer. And you can use foam mounting tape if you want to pop this up a little bit. Or you can just use um, just use regular tape here. And so what I've done is put the image here. I'm going to go ahead and just move this over just a tiny bit. And that is what sticks on the center here. So anyway, isn't that super cute, you guys? I think this is just adorable. I probably put another piece of tape here, but anyway. So there's the finished product, and it's quick and easy. And like I said, if you are doing bazaars, really great thing to do because this is a big seller is watching